Nature causes all living creatures to adapt with the times. As human beings, we too are no different. Body parts that our ancestors had, such as the tail, no longer feature in our anatomy as they have no current use. There are many more aspects of the human body that will soon fade into oblivion. Here is taking a look at 13 body parts that will disappear in the near future. Before proceeding, do subscribe to our channel for more amazing videos. Wisdom Teeth The wisdom teeth are used for crushing and tough morsels of food. However, these days most people depend heavily on processed meals that are easy to chew and digest. Moreover, forks and knives help cut up large pieces of food into bite-sized morsels. This leaves the wisdom tooth redundant in function. In fact, dentists world over have reported observations of fewer people seeing the wisdom tooth erupt. This is a clear sign that these teeth are soon set for extinction. Male Nipples Every body part has a unique function that renders it necessary. However, the male nipples seem to have no possible function. So, how and why did they develop? To answer this, we need to look at the human fetus. Did you know that the human fetus is always female until it is 4 weeks old? This is when the male Y chromosome kicks in and arrests the development of female features such as the breasts. However, until that point, a slight indentation that occurs stays on as the male nipple. Many scientists are convinced that this part of the male body will soon disappear in the future due to its redundancy. Body Hair The primitive man had a carpet-thick layer of body hair to protect his skin from impact of heat and cold. Now, we live in a wide array of clothing and cosmetics suited to protecting our skin in each weather. This pretty much nullifies the purpose of having body hair. Research indicates that humans are being born with lesser and lesser body hair. Very soon, body hair will become an almost extinct feature in the human race. This however does not include facial hair which is known to help man attract the opposite sex and therefore has a definite purpose. Appendix the appendix is a thin tube that is located at the junction of the small intestine and the large intestine. In the past, this organ played an important role in digestion. However, at present, it has no clear defined role in the human body. In fact, if the appendix is removed, digestion continues with no impact. This is why scientists believe that in the near future, an entire race of people will be born without the appendix. Third eyelid Many living organisms have a third eyelid also known as a nicitating membrane. This eyelid helps provide additional protection to the eyes. It also keeps the eyes hydrated. Humans have a tiny version of this in the corner of their eyes. Modern research has discovered that due to the fact that we now have advanced means of eye care, the nicitating membrane has lost its purpose in the human anatomy, which is why it too is set to soon disappear completely. Cervical rib also known as a neck rib. The cervical rib is an extra rib that some people are born with. At present, it has no clear defined function in the human body. In fact, the cervical rib can cause pain and discomfort in people who have it. The cervical rib may occur on one side of the body or exist as a pair. Scientists are convinced that this extra rib or pair of extra ribs will soon disappear in generations to come owing to its lack of purpose or function. Darwin's tubercle Darwin's tubercle is a set of cartilage and skin that protrude towards the top half of the ear. While most people do not have it, in some the protrusion is very evident. Centuries ago, this point on the ear was thought to help in amplifying sound waves received by the human ear. Back then man was a hunter and these parts of the body had a specific purpose. However, with the evolution of modern life, man no longer hunts for a living and anatomical features such as the Darwin's tubercle will soon cease to exist. Erector pili muscles We've all had goosebumps at some point in our lives, yet few of us actually know what causes them. Goosebumps are the result of the functioning of the erector pili muscles. These tiny muscles are located at the end of each hair follicle. When the human body is exposed to extreme cold, the erector pili muscles contract in order to generate heat. This causes the bumps to form on the surface of the skin and leaves the body hair looking like it's standing up. In the past, these muscles had puff up in a threatening situation in order to seem larger and more intimidating to the enemy. This function is now redundant and therefore the erector pili muscles look like they are set to soon disappear. The tailbone also known as the coccyx. The tailbone marks the end of the spine. In primitive times, it marked the beginning of the tail in the human ancestors. Pretty much the same like monkeys have now. 
However, as time passed by, the human race evolved to exist without a tail. The tailbone thus became a redundant part of the human anatomy. While the tailbone still helps support certain pelvic muscles, its main function of being the start of a tail no longer holds. This is why scientists feel that the human body will soon drop off the tailbone and learn to survive without it. Subclavius muscle the subclavius muscle is a tiny muscle that is situated between the collarbone and the start of the first rib. It functions to stabilize the collarbone while moving the arm and shoulders. The main purpose of this muscle is to create body stabilization while walking on all fours. As we no longer walk using all limbs, the function of the subclavius muscle is pretty redundant. This makes it pretty much a reality that this muscle might soon fall off the biological construct of the human body. Palmaris longus muscle The palmaris longus is a forearm muscle that extends between the elbow and the palm. In the past, this muscle helped our ancestors grab a firm hold while climbing rocks and trees. As we live relatively more comfortable lives now, the palmaris longus muscle offers no real purpose to justify its existence in the body. In fact, statistics show that a large number of people are being born without this muscle at all. This is a clear indication that evolution has deemed this muscle fit for extinction. Extrinsic Ear Muscles Here are some more muscles to make it to this list. The outer ear has muscles that were once capable of helping our ancestors pivot their ears and catch sounds. This movement is quite similar to the way in which dogs, cats and rabbits move their ears. While these muscles still exist, they have lost much of their ability to move sharply. While some people can still wiggle their ears, most of us have a very limited range of movements by the extrinsic ear muscles. Before we reveal the final body part to make it to this list, we have an audience question for you. What do you feel humans of the future will look like? Will they look very different from how we do at present? Give us a peek into your vision in the comments below. As always, we love hearing from you. Toes Perhaps the most shocking reveal is that humans could possibly lose their toes several thousand years from now. New research has revealed that the center of balance of the foot mainly rests on the side of the big toe and the ball of the foot. This stands in sharp contrast to primitive times when the toes held prime importance. This means that the toes, which primarily function to help us balance, will soon be rendered in excess in the anatomy. This could hint that they might eventually disappear. Of course, this is one change that will take several thousand years to happen. Like what you saw? Do support us by hitting the like button. Comment below and let us know the ones you're eager to catch. Hope you enjoyed our video and do not forget to share. For more great content, subscribe to our channel. See you next time.